William Accio is off the mark and he has scored his first of many for Ross County, scoring in a late equalizer to tie the game 1-1 late against Aberdeen to earn himself and his club Ross County a late 1-1 draw and point. And this is a huge moment for William Accio, showing his quality and why the club brought him in. He came on in his debut and scored 44 minutes and he was quality. Of course, it wasn't the prettiest of goals. It still took some skill, some intelligence, and some footballing know-how. It was a long throw which found William Accio at the back post. He still took some skill to score it, but these are goals that a lot of people will play down. It's one of those goals where you're at the right place at the right time, but it's not luck. This is a goal where a number nine finish, a poacher's finish, where you know where to be, you have the football intelligence, you're there, and you're at the right spot at the right time. That's just footballing intelligence. I don't like when people play this goal down because William Accio deserves the praise here and he has shown why they brought him in from the CPL and I'm so excited for him. He is now playing with two other Canadians of course in Victor Latore, another CPL export and of course Ben Payton and it's great that he's playing with some other Canadians out there as well and this is the reason why we made the Canadian Premier League to export players like William Accio, give them a chance at the big shot and they're playing and he is only 24 years old. He is still not even at the middle of his career, he is still firing all cylinders. And you look at Ross County and the Scottish Premiership, it is still a very good league. You're playing against Champions League sides like Rangers and Celtic, proving himself on the big stage. He's still playing against teams like Aberdeen with a lot of history and out there. And this is just a quality transfer for William Accio and of course Victor Latore. I'll talk about Latore in another video sometime soon, but this is so exciting for William Accio, proving why he's one of those top Canadian Premier League exports and why he still has a lot to show out there. Of course, he had 10 appearances for Valor FC, scoring 5 goals. He was absolutely brilliant in the Canadian Premier League, and that is why Ross County brought him in. They needed goals, and he is a man who can deliver. And he showed that. 44 minutes on his debut, 95th minutes, he shows up. He's there. He scores that goal, and William Macchio is the man. And I'm so excited to see what he can do with Ross County in a very good Scottish Premiership. I don't like how people play down the Scottish Premiership, especially Canadians. Because I do think this league is on par, close to par with the MLS. You can look at coefficient and whatnot. But I'm still always going to look at Champions League teams and Champions League quality sides, Europa League quality sides, and playing against them a couple times a year or more than that is a lot better than playing the MLS. I'm sorry, but that's just how I feel. And when William Macchio can get consistent minutes and consistent starts, and he's looked at as the man up top or on the wing, then he's even going to show his quality even more. Maybe he'll get a jump up to a Celtic, a Rangers, or even better, a, maybe a move away even to uh, Premier Liga, to the Belgian League. William Accio is a ceiling ahead of him, as well as Victor Latore, and this is a brilliant way to start off for William Accio. First goal, first debut, off the mark, and he is scoring. And it is not just going to be one. This is his first of many, and this is very exciting for William Accio. Let me know what you guys think down below, especially Valor FC fans, Kahneman T fans. What do you guys think of that William Accio, and what is his ceiling? Do you guys think he's going to kill Ross County? I'm very excited to hear from you guys down below. I want to make all these Canadian men um, videos and of course around all of our rising stars and I know William Accio is one to look out for and I'm going to keep an eye close on them guys. I hope you guys are enjoying all my Canadian men's national team content. William Accio to stack your excellence and of course that Ismail Akone video and Umar Diallo. Let me know what else you guys want to see down below in the comments. I got lots more video ideas. I'm not running thin. There's so much to talk about around this Canadian men's national team. Scott Kennedy, his brilliant performance in 90 minutes. Theo Corbinu. I'm so excited for this channel, guys. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comments. Hit that like button. Hit that sub. It means the absolute world to me, guys. I'm only going to bring you guys the best content. And I'll see you guys for the next one. Peace.